so for your hair, I obviously have long hair, um, and I'm going to try to show you some styles that can work with short to medium hair too. Obviously my hair is already dry, I'm just going to refresh it with a few drops of either a serum or an oil. I run that through your hair. This will act as a heat protectant because I'm going to be blowing it out a little bit. So this brush works better for my hair since it's longer. And I am using the Baby Bliss Pro, um, it's the Ferrari hair dryer. I just got it and I love it. If you need a new dryer, I highly recommend it. And I'm just going to be blowing out my bangs, kind of going off to the side. So go ahead and just wash and rip. was just to kind of give it some more body and some shape. Um, basically you want to roll everything upwards and you want to point it the direction that you want it to lay. So we're going up and back for my bangs and then when you let them out you can kind of just shake them out. And I'll help encourage them to just swoop off this way softly. Okay. Now if you want a little bit more volume, just pick up about an inch section of the top of your hair and lightly brush backwards. You're kind of flicking your wrist and letting your hair fall. And brush over with the side of the comb. Now that'll just give you kind of light volume. I'm gonna repeat this on both sides of my head. You can do one side in front, one side in back. But there's just one idea that you can do. The next look for your hair, I'm going to do a half up, half down with some volume. Um, this looks really professional because everything is just off your face and it just opens up your face. So again, we're going to back comb the top and taking a section behind that. I'm going about the middle of my head. You don't need to go too far on this, especially since it's not a glamour shot. And I'm back coming about three inches away from my head. This will ensure that the tease is even all the way around. Okay, I'm taking from the top of my ear all the hair that will go back from there, and in the back, I'm simply just going to twist it and push up a little bit. Okay, and now when you're securing your hair, you want to put the body in one direction and then turn it the opposite direction. And to make sure that stays, you want to cross, cross your pin. are done with that part. What's great about teasing your hair is you can mold your hair to where you want it to stay. If we didn't back comb it, it would just fall flat. So I'm just going to kind of fluff it and get it to where I want it to lay. For my hairspray, I'm using Suds Effects. This one is also really great if you are in a hurry um, and you need to blow dry your hair. Spray this all over and it helps you cut your drying time really quick too. 